These pieces of equipment, these plain, seemingly unremarkable boxes with their dials and diodes and circuit boards, save your life every day, a hundred times a day. They make your cars and boats safe. They keep your power stations running. They keep your planes airborne. They ensure that your bridges are strong enough to cross and that your trains run true. These pieces of equipment and the trained and skilled people who operate them are all around you, yet remain unseen. And the best part is that all of this goes on without anything stopping and without any parts being damaged. It's called non-destructive testing, or NDT as some of us like to call it. Not heard of it? Let's take a look. Non-destructive testing is all around us, all the time. It is what it says, testing something without destroying or harming it. One of the most familiar forms of NDT in medicine is the ultrasound test that medical staff use to check the development of babies in their mother's womb. Here, the clinician can check that the baby's head, spine, limbs, even internal organs are all growing correctly. Obviously, this all has to be done without harming the mother or baby, and that's the magic of NDT. We know everything is well, but nothing has been harmed. To show you how NDT is keeping you safe in your everyday life, let's follow a normal family as they set off on holiday. Structures such as this bridge have to be tested regularly without being shut down and critical parts of the bridge are also constantly checked for signs of any cracking. The box construction of the bridge and the decking contains hundreds of thousands of welds that have to be regularly inspected for any surface or internal defects. These are tested using magnetic particle and ultrasound inspection. Under this bridge is an RNLI lifeboat station. These lifeboats have extremely strong but light hulls which are regularly tested using a form of NDT called laser shearography. Our railways too rely on NDT to keep running effectively. This test is using ultrasound to check for defects in the track. And these trains have been specially designed to test the track at a safe speed. They run along the track and sensors gather information to be analysed. We all rely on the energy created by power stations. And in turn, power stations rely on NDT. This tour group are learning how this gas-fired power station works. They see the huge boilers which superheat water to create energy. The huge pressure exerted on these pipes, tanks and welds mean that every part of this system has to be checked regularly for potential weaknesses. This NDT engineer is using a thermal imaging camera to check the insulation on this part of the plant. All the prepared food available to you has passed through NDT. Everything from a pre-packed sandwich to these chocolate bars is tested at the end of the production line to ensure that no foreign bodies, such as metal, get into your food. When we buy petrol, we never see the long and complex route it takes to reach our tank. Petrol is made from crude oil, 
which is extracted from the seabed using offshore platforms. These platforms are non-destructively tested during construction and during their operational life, often using underwater inspection. And the welds on the pipelines which carry the oil to land are tested to ensure they are strong enough for the job. And when the oil reaches the refinery, where it is turned into petrol, the refinery itself has to be tested in operation and during construction. Here, the integrity of the supporting legs of this storage sphere is being checked using eddy current technology. NDT is even used in every stage in the manufacture of every car on the road. As well as ultrasound, cars require testing using radiography, electromagnetism, and special dyes are sprayed to reveal very fine surface cracking. Here we see ultrasound being used to test spot welds on various car parts. It's easy to imagine the stresses and strains which the structure and the welds of an amusement park or fairground rides go through all the time. Every ride in operation undergoes a variety of tests for safety reasons. These tests include magnetic particle inspection and ultrasonics. And as our family arrive at the airport, we can look at the industry which absolutely relies on NDT to ensure it remains one of the safest modes of transport, air travel. Every plane that flies is regularly taken into the hangar and tested from nose to tail. The engines and other vital parts are often removed from the plane and tested in laboratory conditions. Right back at construction of the plane, tests like this eddy current inspection are carried out on many vital components. And today, one of the most renowned aerospace engine manufacturers in the world even has the ability to monitor their engines while in flight. This is the headquarters of the British Institute of Non-Destructive Testing. One of the Institute's roles is to help newcomers to the industry develop career opportunities through various training courses, apprenticeship schemes and university programmes. Training is available in all areas of NDT and fully trained students can be assured of a rich, rewarding and exciting career, whichever route they choose. As we have seen, NDT has a crucial role to play in all aspects of modern life. As the pace of life quickens, then NDT has to adapt, change, improve and rise to these challenges. Research into novel NDT methods plays a vital role in every major industry on all continents. And as humankind looks beyond the Earth for its future, NDT is playing a real and active part in taking us there. If you're interested in a career in NDT, there are opportunities all around the world now. And the very real chance to one day go above and beyond.